Hey there friends, thanks for checking in at the range now and I've got the Henry repeating arms lever action axe in 410. Get a load of this. Many people liked this firearm when I did my tabletop review. I took a few shots at an indoor range but we're outdoors now on a cold snowy day but we got to check this thing out. Now a couple things about the lever action axe. The overall length is 26 inches. It's got a 15.1 inch barrel bead sight five shells of two and a half inch 410 shot loads all right and then uh, there is the magazine tube and it does have a barrel clamp beautiful american walnut lever action side loader and the rounds that i have in here are remington triple aught buckshot with four pellets and it's traveling at 1225 feet per second let's see how it does uh, let's go with that center. The thing about the 410 is everybody in the house could use it. It's very light recoil. And yet it packs a punch. If anybody tells you that four pellets of 410 is not good enough for self-defense coyote, then uh, I think they need their brains examined because I talk to people in the medical field and they say, Yep, they say that uh, that 410 can really put a hurt. Everything depends on the load. With that goes across the board with all shotgun loads. But this thing is really cool, and it's a very light recoil. Even though it's triple out buck, you get a load of that right there. It does have the logo engraved on the back. It does have a sling mount, okay, in the fore end, down by the grip, and then the lever action is really nice. Here we go again, I've got one in the chamber, hammer cocked back, it does have a transfer bar safety in there, but I'm gonna shoot from the hip this time, I'll move forward a little bit, see if I can hit the target. Go over here to the left, oh yeah. A little low on the coyote, I'll raise it. Oh. There we go, and there we go. Many people said when I reviewed this earlier as a tabletop review that the MSRP is 970 and they said that was way too much for this. But I checked on Gun Broker as well as some other sites and this is being sold for right around 750. It's very small, very lightweight, easy to operate and light recoil. But another thing that I did on my tabletop review is I demonstrated the effects of 410 from a an actual shotgun with a longer barrel and so there's a huge difference between shooting the 410 in a 15 inch barrel or 18 inch barrel opposed to a handgun and what I did was I brought out a rock solid uh, milk jug of ice and I shot that now I've got some more self-defense ammo we're gonna shoot at a milk jug with frozen ice and see what effect the 410 has on that target all right, so here's the milk jug. Rock solid of ice. And we're gonna see what this Winchester PDX-1 410 shot shell will do. This has three plated, it's called defense discs, and 12 plated BBs. This is traveling at 750 feet per second, two and a half inch, 410 loads. Let me set it up and we'll see what happens. I did this range test six years ago and I was eight yards away from the target, so that's how far we are now from that solid ice milk jug. Here is the PDX-1. You can see that plate there. There are three of those and 12 discs. This is to prove all the 410 haters wrong. Also, to get that thing out of my freezer, I had it there for over three weeks, so my wife was like, are you gonna get that thing out? Yep, I'm shooting it today. Let's see how it goes. Boom! I told you guys. Turning it into snow. Is it on camera? Yep. All right, so we're a little closer now than eight yards, but I think my point is made. And it turned, it turned that into snow. Let's take a look.
And so here we have, which was once a solid block, back off here, once a solid block of ice is now snow. And there's the wad. Wow. I turned the camera around to demonstrate the low recoil from the lever action X 410. I've got the Remington triple up buckshot loaded up right now. Many people ask me, will this fire slugs? And yes, it will fire slugs. However, it comes installed with a full and vector style choke. And they also have a choke wrench that they include. Now, I would not shoot a slug with a full choke. I'd put a modified choke in there, and it'll shoot slugs all day long. I don't have a modified choke for this. So right now, we're going to stick with the shot shells. But here we go. Check out this light recoil. Let's we'll start with the Coyote. Very light rabbit looks like one more will go right right over here man this is a nice firearm i really enjoy it i enjoy it quite a bit i think uh henry did a nice job it looks beautiful it fires really nice and it's the type of firearm that would make a good home defense gun just because everybody could use it given that it is low recoil and that 410 is pretty deadly if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe